week, okay? Oh. Almost all of us know the Asotagari, I'm sure. We're going to review the Asotagari. We're going to add the arm bar at the end. Okay. <laughs> we'll start first from 50-50 judo grips. He's got me, my collar. I've got his collar. He's got my sleeve. I've got his sleeve right at the elbow. I'm bunching up all the fabric, so I have really good control of his arm. I don't want a loosey-goosey grip. Okay. Um, so for the Asotagari, we're going to step our foot on the side where I have his sleeve out next to his foot. And I want to elevate the elbow and pull him into me. Okay? If I don't elevate the elbow and I go to step, he's just going to step on me. And I'm not going to get there. Got to elevate the elbow to, to bend that elbow so that he can't stop my forward advance. And I'm pulling him onto this foot so that when I sweep him, he goes over. Okay? So you're going to do one, two, all right? Three. So this leg comes through and you're sweeping it inside, pointing your toe inside so it shortens the leg, hooking behind his thigh and elevating his thigh with your thigh. So no one there, no one there. It looks like this. Okay. I'll do it real quick here. So you're gonna do two practice entries like this. One, see I'm shifting his weight onto this foot and then on the third one, okay, great ball, that was good. Same thing, I'm keeping the grip, bringing my shin into his armpit, stepping over the head, sitting back, arm bar. Okay. Thank you, James. One more, this should be a review for everybody. We're getting our judo grips, boom, boom. Okay, we're doing two practice entries. One, see how I'm bending his weight onto that leg, and on the third one, help our uh, shin into the armpit, keeping the grip, stepping over the head, Sitting with it all back nice and tight. Yeah. Okay. Any questions? Should be a move we all know. Okay. Partner up, let's run it. One, two, three. Did you need to be a partner? Huh? Did you yep. see how 